Okay, I relax, boom, there's the shot. Notice the moment I trap, boom, this hand relaxes. Then I go, boom, there's the shot. See, it's an eruption, it goes through the body. So let's go over, let's review a paksa, and then we'll do it from the movement. Okay, so the first thing that I want to change, see this? I don't want this any, okay? Because when we're doing this, you're training yourself to be square instead of being bladed. Next, instead of this hand being round, I was straight, I want it round and relaxed like a circle, see? See, it's round, I'm here, it's round. Instead of like saying, I need that reference point. I want this roundedness, because when you're rounder, you're stronger. This force comes through my body, okay? Then don't be too round and don't be too rigid. Do you see this? So I don't want this. See, when you do this, do you see the tension? There's already tension. I just need this. I need to start from relaxation. Keep that hand up, please. I'm going to practice the paksa. There's three things to a paksa. The first thing to a paksa is going to be, the, there's three elements. One is the footwork. Two is this hand, the trapping hand. And three is the hitting hand. Okay? So the first thing I'm going to show you is the footwork. It's a push shuffle, not a step and slide. Do you follow what I'm saying? It's not this, because when I do that, where's half my weight? It's that way. Now look where I'm at. I'm ready to be taken down. Okay, so it's not this. Do you follow? It's, you see how all three happen at the same time? So for when I'm here, this is first. That goes, and there's the shot. The next thing, the pock is here. It's right there. It's right there. But it's not my hand doing it, it's my body doing it. And as my hand is not pushing, it's my body coming forward. The next thing I notice with the pox is people put their wrists like this when they pock. That's gonna hurt your wrist. The position is like this. So when you practice on the mukjong, it's like this. This is what's strong. So when I go here, boom, see? It's here, okay? So when I go, there's the shot. But my feet have to come forward. You see, and that's how I come forward. So there's three pieces. Number one, shuffle your foot. Number two, hand comes from here, not from here. It's already here, right? In our starting position, remember this? I want you from here, see? This is where I want it from. Remember our start position was here, right? 45s, 45s, this is where I want it from. And then this thumb, see this thumb? Touches my chin. That's when I know it's covering and it's ready to go from here and not from down here. Because if he runs that hand and my hand's down here, run it, boom. Or he, without even a pocket, he runs it. It's already there. This needs to be here. In case he runs it, it runs into this. If he runs it, go, I can cover. But if my hand's down here, he's hitting me all day. So I need this here and I need this here. Okay, so now I shuffle from the back. I trap here, not here. See this part here? I'm going to leave good five prints here so you can see where it is, okay, <laughs> clearly. And I relax. It has to be from a, a relaxation. Do you feel what I'm saying? It has So I want you to first relax and not get tense, because when I get tense, I tell him. I need to go down and relax and erupt from there. <laughs> Got it? Three pieces. The hand. The feet shuffle, the hand goes, okay? So we're here, boom, there's the shot. And look where I recover to. I go here, you see I go and I pull it back, but I recover to here. I don't do this, I can shoot and leave it open. I recover here in this round structure. I go, bam, see, I recover here. So I'm ready to do what I wanna do after. <laughs> 